L'autre question euh, Bonjour John. Alors, vous avez expliqué tout à l'heure euh, que l'animation en image de synthèse était une sorte d'hybride entre l'animation dessin animé et l'animation en live. Et j'aimerais savoir ce que vous pensiez de la performance capture, donc la technique avec laquelle on a réalisé Avatar, le Pôle Express et bientôt Tintin, enfin, et qui est une sorte d'hybride entre justement l'animation CGI et le live action. Uh, I'm not a big fan personally of, of at Pixar of doing any kind of motion capture, performance capture, because one of the things that we love to do is to create the motion you know, with animation. Performance capture ma really makes sense in the world like Avatar where you're taking and creating effects that fit into a live action film because this, the, the, when you look at a live action film, there's a way that people, humans move that fit with that reality, which is the live action film. When you take a step back and create a very caricatured world, the motion needs to be caricatured to make it feel believable for that world. It, it seems extremely strange when you see motion capture, very realistic motion of a human being, then applied to a very caricatured, caric a stylized world. It somehow doesn't fit. It no longer seems believable. It's a little weird, right? Mm -hmm. And so to, to us, there's a philosophy of matching the level of caricature of the motion to fit with the world you're creating. And the goal is to make the world very believable for the story you're telling. It's also taking away one of the most fun parts of the animation process, the creation of the animation. You know, as an animator, I cannot tell you the creative satisfaction you get with cre crafting a scene in animation, and, and there's a certain point when it comes alive. And it's no longer a creation, it's actually a thinking character. It's got emotion and personality through pure movement. It's really exciting. And it's a great skill. And it's, you know, it's one of those crafts that have been around for a long time. And it's crafting those performances of what we learned, what I learned from the great Disney animators. And, and it's, it, it is so much a part of the creation of our films. I mean, the story ideas come out of how we're going to animate it, you know, and we, and the animators are like actors, and they work, you work with the animation. So we're, we're dedicated at Pixar and at Disney Animation to, you know, to sticking with, you know, animation. And, you know, I, you know, we won't do motion capture, but it doesn't mean that, that some filmmaker will take it like James Cameron with Avatar and really do something magnificent with it.